a little nippy today. I'm excited. I like cold weather. And when you're living in Florida, you barely get that. And I've been waiting for some decent weather. Um, but the only thing is, I had to make sure my skin was moisturized because in colder weather, um, the skin does tend to get dry and crack, but I still love it because then like in hotter weather, my skin gets stressed out and sweats and break out. It's like, I can't win. Um, so I'm on my way to work. I'm late as fudge because the bed felt too, too good. And I was like, I don't want to get up. And I didn't set alarms anyways. Like I went to sleep last night. I edited yesterday's vlog and I uploaded it. And then I was like, I just fell asleep. And I didn't set any alarms. I woke up alone by 6, uh, 6.45 and I debated. I was like, should I just stay up or no, I can sleep for 15 more minutes. That 15 more minutes turned into almost 25 minutes. So yeah, I text the teacher I work with that I'm running late. But then once I was ready, I couldn't find my car keys. And I was like, really? I couldn't find my car keys. I couldn't find a scarf because I have asthma on top of it. And when it's cold and if I don't cover my chest, my asthma will bother me. And, you know, I just can't deal with a flare-up and an asthma attack at the same time. This is not the thing I want to do. Um, my skin feels a lot better from taking the bleach bath and slabbing steroids all over. I'm actually going to put a, um, a refill prescription to get more because, like, I had that jar since August and because I had a terrible summer and um, I just been using it just whenever I felt like my skin was getting bad and it, I, like I said I don't really heavily depend on steroids but like it's like always my emergency backup when I like when all my oils can't do it like I use rosehip oil I use jojoba oil I use tea tree oil I'm using CBD oil I'm using aquaphor I'm, like I'm using the whole works and like when those cannot keep my skin moistured or help it, I have to crack out the, the big guns, you know. So I'm just gonna I'm gonna put in a uh, refill prescription today because I want to slab more on tonight. I hate when I'm late. I just feel so disoriented. There's no parking spot. Look where I have to park. There goes my little car, lonely by the dumpster. I just feel like I'm set behind. Like I was a half hour late to work, basically. I, the traffic was disgusting. The donuts took forever to get me some hot chocolate. It's lunchtime. Oh, it's been a crazy morning. I had like a little rehearsal because like one of the songs in the holiday show, it's like a rocket number. And in me, I was like, oh, let's do a little rocket, have the girls do a little dance. And I've been teaching a pre-ballet tap class. And I was like, oh, we could kind of feature the tap. You know, I, I made the dance very like marchy and heel toey, where you can kind of hear the sounds of the taps or whatever. That rehearsal was, <laughs> was a disaster. And I'm having lunch. I'm having leftovers. It is some um, baked ziti from this pizza restaurant nearby my um, apartment. Um, I'm gonna put it in a plate, throw it in the microwave, warm that up, and bon appetit. Um, let me show you my skin. Like my forehead's doing a little better. It's not like too scabby and peeling, but right here, this area, yeah, I'm very flaky, but it's okay. I'm outside at like a kitty table eating my ziti, which once I stepped outside, cooled it right down from the heat. Cause I heat it extra, right? I only have like five minutes to finish my break because everybody stopped and talked to me, but it's okay. All right, I'm just gonna watch a little Disney Plus <laughs> and be on my way. I'm almost done with my day. I'm here till four today. Um, the group of kids I'm with, um, they're doing an art class for 30 minutes. I gotta clean up this. I had the smart idea to like, let's play with some glue and make snowflakes. 
I mean, but here, here's my snowflake. And then here's some of theirs. They tried though. At least they tried, right? It's 4.30 right now. And I'm supposed to be home. Well, leaving here at 4. And it's 4.30. I don't know why. Things are not going the way I want to. Because I was going to go with dance work. But I guess I So I'm back home. I decided that I'm just not going to do anything tonight. I really, really wanted to do the, um, the dance workshop. But... By the time I got home and I would have to moisturize, find something comfortable but warm to wear, um, and try to leave to get there. With the way traffic is looking, I'm going to get there late and what's the point, you know? You don't want to show up somewhere late, so I'm just going to do an evening in, um, have to study anyways. Take care of a few errands, do a few chores, um, and just take care of myself, you know, my skin flaring up. I just need to relax and just stay calm, do a little reading or journaling. And if you're wondering, what am I wearing? <laughs> I'm wearing a onesie and it has the Grinch. I love my onesie. Um, we have Christmas stickers on the wall. Anyways, I think I'm going to end my uh, vlog for today here. Because work was so... I was all over the place at work. So I didn't have time to do any like talking and vlogging. And I was going to vlog me at the workshop. Or anywhere, you know. Or I was going to do my tap class. But I think sometimes I just have to tell myself no. I don't have to do it all you know do everything you know it's a bummer but i don't want to stress out over it because that my skin is gonna feed on that if eczema really feeds on stress but i'm gonna make some hot chocolate tonight and hopefully get some food i'm looking at my boyfriend and you know just chillax tonight because you know this week is gonna be pretty busy and then next week's going to be super busy because I have the holiday show. I have a performance on Monday. And then the last, then the week after that is like the last week of school before the holiday break. And it's the week before Christmas. It's, it's going to be crazy. So thanks for watching. Subscribe, tell your friends, like, comment. And do you have onesies you like to wear during the holidays?